I'd like to introduce to you the LG Optimus 4X HD. Uh, this comes powered with the NVIDIA Tegra 3 1.5 GHz quad-core processor and thus making it the fastest phone in the world. This comes with a 4.7 inch HD resolution AH in-plane switching IPS display. It also comes with an 8 megapixel powerful camera. Apart from these hardware features, it is loaded with the latest Android operating system, the Ice Cream Sandwich operating system. Uh, apart from this, uh, apart from the hardware and the software uh, innate functions that it has, we have also provided uh, certain customizations which we provide with all our ICS devices called the LG Optimus UI 3.0. We have given innumerable number of twerks starting with the quick memo function which lets you take a screenshot and write on any uh, anything that you have captured in the background. Now say for example I want to circle this, I can easily tell people about the Play Store, uh, share it via memo, Bluetooth, email, Google, Picasa, Social Plus would include all your Facebook, Twitter, etc. I can save it onto the gallery and it goes to my gallery and you're back on the screen. This works particularly well when you're talking on the phone, you're in the midst of a call. Uh, you can just drag the menu down, take a quick memo, somebody's telling you a phone number, you just write it down, 98713, etc. Uh, if you don't want to save it, you want to garbage it, you can just press the back button, it gets garbage, and you're back to your home screen. Apart from this, uh, we also have a very unique feature which is not available in many phones. It's called the on-screen phone. The on-screen phone enables you to connect this device uh, onto your PC and this entire phone appears in its entire being onto your PC. So anything that you do on your phone, whether it's messaging, emailing, gaming, Facebooking, you can do on your, on your PC via a keyboard and a mouse. Uh, apart from this, uh, it offers innumerable number of features. Like I mentioned, it has an 8 megapixel camera, uh, really powerful camera, as you can see. Uh, High, it, it, it enables you to record videos in high definition, it enables you to capture pictures in full high definition 1080p. Not only a powerful camera, it also has certain software twerks with this camera that make it a much more interesting phone. Something known as a time shot. Uh, you click on the time shot, uh, it basically records images about 4 or 5 seconds before you click the shutter. So uh, after clicking on it, you click on this icon and it gives you about four or five different shots about how the camera moves about say two to three seconds before the actual click of the button. You can select whichever image you want and save it onto your gallery and your back camera. When you're taking videos, uh, this is a really interesting feature, uh, in the middle of taking a video, if you also want to capture a picture, there's an icon on the top right hand side which captures an image and sends it right to the gallery and you can continue taking the video without any interruption. Similarly, you have a lot more other features, small little twerks like high definition, uh, like high definition, uh, yeah, like geotagging, multi-phase tagging, high dynamic range which compensates for the backlight, panorama shot which is different from the old technology that was used. Uh, it, it lets you pan to any any amount of distance that you want for the for the video too and combines it into a single image for the panorama shot. So uh, that was the 8 megapixel camera with full HD recording capability, um, the LG UI, the quad core processor, the IPS display. Uh, now this is also a complete sharing device. Uh, it has NL it is an NFC enabled phone, uh, which is common for Android phones these days. Uh, it obviously works on the Android beam uh, fundamentals and lets you share contacts, browser content, uh, application URLs, application links. Uh, but apart from that, we give something known as NFC tags. Uh, let me see if I have one. Yeah. These little things, the NFC tags. Uh, the two of these are given with the phones. Uh, you, these are rewritable NFC tags. Basically, how it works is that you you push your phone onto the NFC tag, and it changes the profile that you uh, have selected for your phone, or it launches a particular application. I don't know whether my uh, tag is configured, but I'm going to try one second. The NFC tag, LG Tag Plus is what it's called. Uh, you can customize these tags using a user mode. Uh, where you can select an application to launch, whether your phone goes on silent or vibrate only or on loud sound, whether you want to create a Wi-Fi hotspot, Wi-Fi GPS. So these are essentially profile settings. Uh, 
uh, that can that can be used by a simple tap of the tag wherever you are, whether it's in your car or in your office or your house, uh, without actually having the need to go to your settings and selecting the profiles that you want. Uh, so that that pretty much covers the little quirks and the little time that I have to explain to you the phone. Uh, quad core processor, 4.7 inch, uh, so fastest processor, largest screen size, uh, full HD, 8 megapixel camera. So everything, 16 GB internal memory, uh, expandable up to 32 GB, uh, 2150 mAh battery.